out here with Chelsea and Jordan here at the very end of squirrel season. We've done this a couple times before, haven't we? Yeah. So uh, how old is uh, Copper now? He's four. Four? Yeah. What type of breed of dog is this now? Mountain Feist. Mountain Feist, okay. So when you guys run a squirrel dog like this, a lot of times you kind of get out of the car, get away from the roads, and then you turn them loose, and do you kind of move them in the direction that you want them to work, or do you just let them do their own thing until they treat one? He usually, he'll just kind of take off on his own for the most part. And he'll usually just do one big, big circle around is usually how he usually operates. We should have plenty of area to work that dog and hopefully get to shoot some squirrels out to him today. Yeah, I think we will, so we'll keep our fingers crossed. I think I hear him now. Let's move on that way. I didn't know the dog had ran this direction, actually. Went up that way and he's so fast. You see it, Chelsea? Now I'm looking. It's in this one right, there's a, a squirrel went in this tree. Oh, I see it now. Good job. You like? Here he is. Come get it, Mama. Come on. Atta boy. That's a good 110, 20 feet. Leave it. Good boy. Good boy. Good boy. Leave it. That is a big fox squirrel. I don't think I've seen one this big before. That's a nice job. I think we're going to see a bunch of them today. I really do. Today's not the perfect conditions. You know, the temperature's in the 30s, but Considering what we've had recently, it's a beautiful day. Looks like Copper's treed. The squirrel heard how Chelsea shoots that rifle. It won't move, it'll hide. You already see it, Chelsea? I see it. Perfect shot. One gray, one fox squirrel. Oh, Copper doesn't know it, but there's a good chance this might be his last squirrel hunt of the year. The season's about to wind down, huh? I hear it, it's got one tree. Do you see him, Chad? I got him, yeah. <laughs> nice. Good boy, good boy, there we go. Little bitty gray squirrel. We're seeing good numbers of squirrels, that's for sure. Really good for upcoming squirrel seasons. <laughs> He's got one tree. Hey, I see one, right here. I tell you what, I think I see another one. Yeah, I think there's a couple in there. Here he comes. You see him? Yeah. Nice job. That was a pretty good size, yeah. You shot that one, got him perfect. Oh, <laughs> nice. Because there's no leaves on the trees and it's just easy to navigate the woods, there's no ticks, we always try to do a squirrel hunt in this time of year. Oh, I see it up there at the very top. See it right there? Oh, yeah. Yeah, that was a good shot. There you go, nice shot. Thank you. I'll tell you what, we were trying to get back to the truck. We've had a heck of a day. Yeah. And uh, sure enough, he treed another uh, another squirrel. We got about 150 yards to go. He may tree another before we get out of here. Might have one more in him, we'll see. This is, this is my favorite time of year. Once the leaves are off the trees, kind of deer season's over, turkey season's not here yet. This is a perfect time to get out and take a walk through the woods, yep. get a little work on the dog. Yeah. It's fun just watching him, really. He's, he's probably the best part of it. He just gets excited about it, and he gets to do what he loves, and yeah. it's just exciting all around. Well, I appreciate you guys bringing the yep. dog out and let me watch it us. work. It was Thanks a lot of fun. Thank you, guys. 
He did great. And hey, we got a mess of squirrels. Yeah, we sure did. All right, let's go. Thank you.